today in a wave optics now to see one numerical numerical is like this way just you can see here a beam of light consisting of two wavelength 650 nanometer and 520 nanometer is used to obtain interference fringes in young's double slit experiment find the distance of the x3 that is a bright fringes on the screen from the central maxima for a wavelength of 650 nanometer and second is what is uh, the least distance from the central maxima where the bright fringes due to both the wavelength coincide that we calculate here to calculate here the given that is here lambda 1 is equal to 65 0 nanometer means tennis power minus 9 meter and lambda 2 is equal to 5 to 0 into 10 power minus 9 meter now here we will get third means n is equal to 3 maxima the condition for third maxima that is here we know that x3 is equal to n lambda capital D upon small d capital now given that is the distance of the between the two slit that is d is equal to 2 millimeter and this distance between slit and screen is 1.2 meter keeping this value here so we can get here x3 is equal to 3 lambda that is a 650 into 10 to the power minus 9 d is 1.2 meter divided by small d that is 2 millimeter means 2 into 10 to the power uh, minus 3 meter Keeping this value and finally solving this, we will get here 1.7 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter, or we can write here 1.7 millimeter. Now, we will solve this. What is the least distance between the central maxima of both these wavelengths? So, both the wavelength here n1 bright fringes. for lambda 1 and n2 bright fringes for lambda 2 are x distance from, from the central maximum. So, we can write here it is n1 lambda 1 is equal to n2 lambda 2 therefore n1 upon n2 is equal to lambda 2 upon lambda 1 is equal to pi to 0 upon into 10 to the power minus 9 pi to 0 into 10 to the power minus 9 divided by 6 pi 0 into 10 to the power minus 9 Solving this will get here 4 upon 5. Now both are at the same distance, so we can write here that is a x equal to 4 lambda 1 capital D upon small d. Keeping this value 4 into lambda 1 that is 6 pi 0 into 10 to the power minus 9 into 1.2 divided by 2 into 10 to the power minus 3. Solving this we have to get here 1.56 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter or you can write here 1.56 millimeter. Similarly for lambda 2 we can write here same answer that is here x is equal to 5 lambda 2 capital D upon small d. 5 into lambda 2 that is a 5 to 0 into 10 to the power minus 9 into uh, that is a d that is 1.2 divided by 2 into 10 to the power minus 3. Solving this we have to get here 1.56 into 10 to the power minus 3 is equal to 1.56 millimeter. So uh, this way to understand this numerical in this numerical two wavelengths are 1650 nanometer and 520 nanometer and the distance of the slit is also given that is a 
2 mm distance of the slit is also given 2 mm and the distance between slit and screen is given 1.2 meter we have to first we have to get here the uh, third bright ridges the distance from the center of central maxis x3 is equal to 3 lambda capital d upon small d keeping the value of lambda that is here lambda 1 we have to put here lambda 1 x3 is equal to 3 lambda 1 d capital d upon small d is equal to 3 into 6 by 0 0 to 10 power minus 9 into 1.2 divided by 2 into 10 power minus 3 solving this way to get here that is a uh, 1.7 into 10 power minus 3 uh, meter or 1.7 millimeter similarly both the waves uh, wavelength are coincide and produce bright fringes of order of n1 and n2 at the dist x distance from the central maxima so we can write here n1 lambda 1 is equal to n2 lambda 2 lambda 1 n1 upon n2 is equal to uh, that is lambda 2 upon lambda 1 keeping the value n5 you can get n1 upon n2 is equal to 4 upon 5 n1 is equal to 4 we have to keep and x is equal to 4 lambda 1 capital D upon small d x is equal to 5 lambda 2 capital D upon small d keeping all this value n5 you can get here 1.56 to 10 to the power minus 3 meter or is equal to 1.56 millimeter so this way to understand this number thank you very much